Welcome to Dr. Tony. We'll talk about today why we do next analysis first before we do actually adjust somebody. This allows people to feel better, understand why they're feeling better, overall stay better once you re-x-ray them. Okay? What we want to do initially is understand that an x-ray analysis allows you to understand what normal curve of the spine is, what normal motion is, and from there what we do is take your x-ray and compare that to, to our normal so you see the difference. Over time, this goal, our goal is to change that your x-ray to a better one, re-x-ray you, which is the key, at that point you see and feel the difference as you add stretches and exercise to your routine too. That's why people come here and stay here and hopefully get better. You don't have to see us, that's the overall plan. Okay? I'm going to turn off lights in a second. You're going to see this overall, you can see an image next to me of what normal is first. We'll go what, now, what I would have normal is after that too. So next to me first, you're going to see a normal x-ray. This x-ray, as you can see, has a, a good curve in there, right? That's called normal alignment, okay? That curve in the spine should be about 42 degrees, just an engineering term. That 40 degrees allows the spine to actually move in a normal position or the body can stay normal. Okay. That space between the bones too, that open, that darker space between the bones, between the spine, allows that, is the disc space, that allows that spacing to stay normal so there's normal motion in the spine again too. In the space behind there, you'll see too, that circle allows the area of the nerve to come through there so overall there's not become pinched. Okay, that pinching can cause neuropathy down the legs, uh, down the arms, but it's in the neck too, allows things to become more locked up and can even cause pain where it doesn't go away. Okay, here's Scott's, uh, in one of our example of our patients, Scott's lower back x-ray. As you can see, his spine curve is okay, but his lower part is where the bones have actually shifted over. Okay, our plan with him over a period of I think about 10 to 12 weeks was to get his body to come back to normal so his leg pain went away. He had a lot of neuropathy, a sciatica down the leg, which is not going away because of previous military service, also his work right now. So over a period of 12 weeks, what we did is treat him with Adjustments for one, two, chiropractic adjustments, we know it's safe from the x-rays, and also two, stretching and exercising, and also icing and other therapies at home, so his body felt better over time. Okay, here's his new x-ray. As you can see, the bones have shifted back to better normal, so nice smooth curves lower back. At this point, his body's about 90% better, so a more work because our scar tissue in there too, but now his body feels better. Okay, now the exercise he's done has made him the confidence he can do more and not hurt himself. A lot of people come in here with problems where they have a lot of pain, they stop doing that to make their body stronger. Our job is getting back to doing some of those things so you feel confident the body's got to get stronger and staying healthy on its own. Again, our overall perspective is to change the x-rays so you see a better x-ray. That's called an x-ray analysis. Take a pre and post so you see the improvement, so you feel and you are confident your x-rays are better. That's the plan. So everything is healed inside. All right, any questions across the call? If not, have a great day. Go ahead, help from the inside out, and we'll see you next video.